Hi guys, my name is Roger, welcome to a new video and in this video I'm going to show you my BCR2000 connected to my MP8000 to control my other equipment and to record movements done with the BCR2000. The MP8000 does have assignable sliders to control uh, other synths and internal uh, sounds also uh, but using the BCR2000 makes it lots more easier to control the other synths and to record those movements. This is very cool, very cool. Uh, my assignable sliders are broken. Well, they do not function very properly, so that's the reason why I bought this one uh, a few months ago. And now I'm controlling also other synths. It's amazing because you can control MIDI CCs, but oh, also you can control SizeX. Cool, super cool, super cool. So I'm going to show you um, some small things. So for example, you hear this bass line. This is an internal sound on the MV8000. And I can control that sound with the BCR. Check it out. Very cool. Also, you can control the pen, for example, to the right, to the left, some volume. And this is very cool. You also can um, record those movements. And I've created, I will point my other camera to the screen, I have recorded some movements I will unmute the track you hear? so I've recorded this one and now it's in the sequence but I can also unmute uh, mute it, so now you don't hear the movements. You hear this Apache beat. And also the Apache beat, you can control. For example this. Let me change the attack of the samples. It looked like... <laughs> you hear? It sounds reversed. But it's not reversed. The starting time is changed. So this is very cool. And also you can record this the movements of of those sounds and um, of those filters so what I did with this filter I have copied that track to another track changed the, the, the number the patch to the Apache beat and then they sound equal. How cool is this? And even, for example, I can um, use other equipment. Now I use the GV2080. And they're all using the same track, the same filter track. Well, copied and uh, adjusted to the uh, correct synthesizer or correct MIDI channel. Oh. 
I think this is very cool. But also, what I said before, is it can control... It can control MIDI CC, but it also can control SciSX. And my MKS-50, which is uh, the rec version of the Alpha Juno, uh, works with SciSX. I have downloaded the template and uploaded it in, into my uh, BCR, and it's on patch number one. Okay, let me give an example, I will record something. How easy is this? So it's recorded already, with the PCR2000 in combination with the MV8000 and the synths. It's super cool. You can do so much. And this is just a simple explanation about the PCR2000 in combination with other equipment and to have control over your sounds. Okay, guys, thank you for watching. Just a simple video. Um, we see each other next time. And then I will dive deeper into the BZR2000 and I will show you a very good, very good, very good program from Mountain Utilities to have complete control over your BZR2000. Cool. Thank you guys. See each other next time. Bye bye. Bye bye.